Estonia's Kaja Kallas has told the media that she believes NATO can stop any potential attack by Russia at the border of the Baltic states after an overhaul of the alliance's defenses. Kallas made a statement at the start of a two-day summit in Lithuania, where leaders signed off on new regional defense plans that will detail how each ally would help to defend NATO's vulnerable eastern fringe. Shocked by the brutality of Russia's invasion of Ukraine, the alliance now says it is switching to a strategy that would halt Russia at its border rather than allow it to take territory. The Estonian leader firmly backed Ukraine's push for membership in the alliance but conceded that Kyiv would not join while war with Russia was raging. We really feel that uh, Na uh, Ukraine is or Ukraine's place is in NATO because uh, the, that is the only security guarantee that works and is the cheapest. That uh, functions as Article 4 uh, in uh, for the NATO's allies. That means that you can call consultations every uh, time like all the members of this council can. Ukraine is an equal member around that table. And what comes to Ukraine, what they will bring to NATO's table is that they are the only army that knows how to fight the Russians. So they actually considering that Russia is considered by uh, NATO to be the biggest threat. They have uh, the knowledge, uh, they have the actual functioning army um, and, and many other things that they bring to the table. Callas had warned ahead of NATO's summit in Madrid last year that her country would be crushed by Russia's forces on the previous alliance plans. NATO countries have now sent thousands more troops to NATO's eastern flank to allow them to respond more quickly to any aggression from Russia. Callas insisted that it was vital that all NATO members fulfill a new pledge to make 2% of their gross domestic product a minimum for defense spending.